This month's grocery haul is going to look very different because <laughs> this is what I have to work with as far as it comes to cooking. We are completely gutting and renovating our kitchen right now. So we do not have a stove, an oven, a kitchen sink currently. I'm hoping that we only go a few weeks without all of that but I am going to prepare for the worst case scenario. This is crazy. When we're living and washing dishes in the bathtub, life is gonna feel chaotic and hectic. There's so many different things, whether it's sports, whether it's moving, whether it's traveling, all different things that make life stressful as a family. So we're gonna share all of the tips, things that worked, and we like to share things that didn't work because we learn equally from those. But anyways, okay, so we're back to grocery shopping. We're gonna still do a monthly grocery haul because, oh, I'm only gonna go grocery shopping one time this month, pretty much. Maybe a few fresh grocery haul pickups in between. But for the most part, gonna sweep up a bit, Mav? Yep. Okay, thanks. For the most part, we're gonna buy everything we need and I'm gonna take you along and show you what exactly we're buying, how much it costs. We're gonna go to Costco and then we'll do one grocery pickup. Got myself ready for the day, which feels like a complete <laughs> win. I used um, a new eyeshadow palette and a new blush that I got in my FabFitFun box. Let me tell you about that real quick and then we'll go grocery shopping. So have you heard about FabFitFun yet? I did, or I shared my winter subscription box with you guys a few grocery hauls ago and you guys loved it so much that I thought, okay, let me share with you my spring FabFitFun box. Thank you to FabFitFun for sponsoring today's video and supporting our channel. What I love the very most about these boxes, which is why I keep talking about it, is the amazing value you get. So depending on what you choose to customize inside your box, each has up to $250 of quality, full size, let me say it again for the people in the back, full size products. And then here's the amazing part, you only pay $54.99 for all of the things that you get in your subscription box. Now keep watching, because here in just a couple seconds, I'm gonna give you a promo code that's gonna save you even more money on top of the amazing savings you're already getting. Now here's an example of the amazing value that I'm talking about. This is the Patrick Star Visionary Eyeshadow Palette, and I am by no means a makeup guru, which, side note, another reason I love this subscription, it helps me try out new products. So anyways, I'm not a makeup guru, but what I do know is that FabFitFun always has quality products, so I know I can trust that what they're putting in my box is something that's actually amazing. I have always loved using the makeup products I've gotten in my subscription boxes over the last few years so I'm super excited to try out this new eyeshadow palette so this palette actually retails for about $42 so I also got this blush as one of my choices for this season subscription and that retails for $40 on its own so if you're doing the math in your head it those two alone together are about 80 bucks which is almost double what you're paying to get the entire box so with just these two products it's more than worth the price of the subscription but you're getting so much more when they say everything in your box is worth up to $250, they are not joking. But you're only paying about $55. Now here's a look at some of the other things that came in my box this season. serum see this is what I'm talking about these are things that I would never like go into a beauty store and buy myself but when they come in this box then I'm like cool I want to try this and so many times then I'm like okay I need this again I'm excited to try out something new that I've never used before mm. cool refreshing gel serum that reduces the look of dark circles oh, okay thank you Thank you, I need this. Oh, I was so excited they had more Kate Spade earrings this month when I saw that. There's lots of different options to choose from. I think it was like, I know sunglasses is another one of them, which is perfect for springtime. But these Kate Spade earrings are always so cute. Look how pretty they are. So sparkly. I feel like these are gonna make me feel super glam. These would be so perfect for date night with hubby. I feel like they're the perfect size too. Not too big, not too little. So sparkly and fun. Whipped argon 
body oil. Yes. Even in the early springtime, it's still so dry. Oh, it's making me so excited. It smells like springtime. Are you a springtime fan? Let's chat that in the comments. What's your favorite season? You don't want to waste this stuff. You gotta really use it. What's your favorite season? Spring, summer, those are my favorites. Oh, it smells so good. I love that it's not oily. It doesn't feel like it's sitting on your skin, but it's actually being absorbed. Perfect. Then, last thing. Ultra hydrating ceramide moisturizer. An intense moisturizer that replenishes dry, distressed skin with lasting hydration. But this is for your face. Use in the morning and night, so this is a face lotion. <laughs> Can you tell I feel like I've, I, I, I do not have enough hydration in my skin? These are my picks. I really was excited about them. Ooh, got a little, oh, magnetic. That's fun. Soft. So this is a seasonal membership where you only pay $54.99 per season's box. As a seasonal member, you get to customize four products in each box. If you sign up as an annual member, you save even more money by paying only $199 once a year, and you get to customize the entire box each season. There's a third option where you don't have to pick anything, and FabFitFun will just send you a box full of surprise goodies. Okay, now here's the bonus I was telling you about. When you use our code that you see here on the screen, we'll also remind you down in the description, when you use that that code, you're gonna get an extra $10 off on top of the amazing value that you're already getting. So for your first box, you're only gonna be paying about $44.99 for everything that you get in there. I can't stress enough what an amazing deal this is. Now, don't forget to click the link in the description of this video and then make sure to use our code to save yourself that extra cash and you're gonna get yourself some fun products to treat yourself. All right, okay, let's go grocery shopping. All right, everyone's got their treats. <laughs> ice cream, ice cream, churro. Churro for mom, what? Maybe we're emotionally eating. Can you help? Maybe life is feeling a little extra stressful because of the renovation and it's only been day two. Day three. It's okay. Oh, pushing this cart with three kids is not easy. All right, here we go. Oh, guys. What about cinnamon rolls for dessert tonight? Yeah. Okay. These are really good. It's cinnamon pull apart bread. Mmm. Oh yeah, this one's got lots of frosting. $6.99. So good. Alright. Stew is a perfect slow cooker meal. So we're gonna get some stew meat. It's $6.49 per pound, which is kind of expensive. But that's what we're going for. $31. So that's gonna cover us for one meal. And then I'm gonna get these two packs of roast. So we're gonna do roast twice this month. Um, 35, 88, 36, 35, and that is 5.99 a pound. Two dinners, two dinners. Okay, the other thing we're gonna do is buy a bunch of what I call Costco dinners. And they're just the things that you can pretty much just heat up in the microwave. So I'll show you that. But we're also gonna link some of the, um, We've done videos on it. So there's two different videos that I've made that give you the full breakdown of how to make them into a dinner. Oh, this is really hard to find. You're hurting me, mom. <laughs> dinner tonight, we're gonna have a hot rotisserie chicken with some mashed potatoes and salad. <laughs> okay, these Kevin's dinners are so delicious. Great, clean ingredients. They don't taste like preservatives. They don't taste like a freezer meal. They're so, so good. And I need eight Costco dinners. And so I'm gonna get one of the Korean beef chicken and one of the peppercorn steak tips. Okay, these mashed potatoes are really good. $7.29 for two. So there's two in one. They microwave, great. And they taste pretty good. They're not homemade, but they taste pretty good. Okay, these scalloped potatoes, $6.29, also so delicious. We're not going for healthy with these things, but we are going for quick, easy, and delicious. Okay, I think I'm gonna freeze one of these. It's a chicken Alfredo, 
super pricey for a pasta dish, but I think I can freeze it. That'll be easy. $14.99 for two pounds of this um, Italian dry salami. Great for homemade um, Lunchables. Great. So easy to put in a lunch. So, the, wait, Mom. Yeah. So, it's only sliced in the middle? It's like this. Like pieces that you put on your sandwich? No, I want the whole thing. Why? So you can cut off things? Yeah. Uh, okay. Huh. yeah. okay, 10 39 for that. Oh, That's two and a half pounds of the sliced cheddar. Great for the lunches. Or would you guys rather have $12.99 for this one? Or would you guys rather have these? Yeah, these. Yeah. These? Yeah. Oh, okay. Kids prefer these. That's what I was talking about. Oh, okay. $8.99 for a 24 ounce Caesar salad kit. Okay, we need some paper towels. They're usually about $17. We get the Kirkland brand, $17.99. $3.49 for 40 pounds of dog food. $11.79 for 44 bags of popcorn. No, 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 not that one. <laughs> microwave. We kind of really like air pop, but microwave is easiest for us right now. $6.49 for 20 ounces. That's a huge bag of our very favorite tortilla chips. So good. $10.79 for some goldfish crackers. $9.49 for 24 pouches of applesauce. You guys want mini wheats or honey nut Cheerios? Yeah, I don't really like Cheerios. Let's get crazy. Yeah, Cheerios. I get I, no, no Cheerios. Okay. Let's get crazy. Eight ninety nine. Let's get crazy. Bought this a couple months ago, and I talked about how it's a great option for like healthier chicken nuggets. We dip it in ranch and buffalo sauce, microwave it, then saute it for a couple seconds. So good. So this is fifteen ninety nine for only three pounds. So it's pretty expensive. Of course, for the kids, we always get the Dino Buddies. $13.69, I feel like that's more expensive than before. $9.59 for three unsweetened almond milk. All right, a good, quick chick, uh, Costco dinner. Gonna be these chicken bakes. Six of them for $10.99. $11.99, the kids like these cheese ones. They don't like the beef ones. $11.99 and there's 30 in there. $13.49 for some freezer pizzas, you just, Really cannot beat that price. 1079 for frozen strawberries. Smoothies, we kept our blender out so we can still make smoothies. 989 for 18 fudge bars. Nine or 1079 for 40 mini drumsticks. We'll see if the kids like these. Do you guys want these? Yeah, yeah, yeah. They're the small ones. Do you guys like the small ones? Yeah. Uh, yeah, they, I don't think they have much ice cream in them. I think you're right, Kennedy. Three thirty-nine for twenty-four count of burritos, quesadillas. Great quick lunch that we can do on our little griddle. Seven forty-nine for a twenty-four pack of um, English muffins. We have a little thing that we can make breakfast sandwiches in that just plugs in, so that's easy. Two forty-nine for some Francisco hamburger buns. Costco is about $450. So my budget's usually around $500, um, though I was planning to go a little bit over today um, because we're buying a lot of convenience food. So we need to go get quite a bit of snacks because Costco doesn't have that much of a variety. Snacks. Snacks. And um, a few fresh produce items. And I'm tired. Okay, let's go to Walmart. Okay, we've got some chaos. So tilapia was $20 for, how much is in here? Four pounds, 85% lean ground um, hamburgers. These were not at Costco, so I had to get them here. A few treats, this is only three. These are for my workers at home. Those are about five bucks for three, and then two bucks for 12 popsicles. Some bagels, those are about 2 dollars each. Um, then we got three lemons, some celery, carrots, and cucumbers. Celeries, carrots, those last a long time, and they're gonna be good in stews and roasts and things like that. 162 for some green enchilada sauce. Anyone that's going on with bone broth? I haven't been able to find it at Costco. Look at all they have left is one, oh wait, two, 
Three chicken bone broth, 282 each. Hmm. Okay, look it. There is no pasta on the shelves. We need spaghetti, so I guess we're gonna have to go with what's down here. 78 cents for angel hair? Angel hair spaghetti. And then we needed the spiral pasta. I think we'll have to settle with mini farfelli. These are so good on crackers. Keep them in the fridge. They're $1.20 for each, so they're just about the same price as that. Obviously, you're getting less, but one serving has 17 grams of protein. Huh. Six of these for $4.38 or 12 of... Oh, no, it's 18. Okay, that makes more sense. I don't mail, but I only have one kid who likes it, so I'm just going to get the six-pack for $4.38. $3.38 for one box of Cheerios because just one kid is getting that. And we love the Protein Nature Valley Granola. They only have the Cranberry Almond, which I'm guessing the kids will not like. Let's see. Honey Oat Granola. $2.25. Snack. Okay. $6.28 for the big thing of pretzels. $3.98 for the last thing of mint Oreos. Now this is going to be my own snack. I don't think so. Okay. Do you guys like wheat thins? Yeah. One yes? Two no's? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I like the Triscuits. So let's get the plain Triscuits family size for four forty eight. Well, good like with the, the hey, tuna. Oh, you like them too? Yeah, yeah I like them. Oh, okay. I awesome. like those. Oh, okay. Let's get two of them then. Alrighty. We've got a gallon of milk for three twenty eight each. We got a bunch of these yogurts with to go with the granola. Those are about a buck each. And then vanilla, Costco or Walmart brand were fifty cents each. That's a great price. Let me see what the protein is. 15 grams, 15 grams. Ingredients, pasteurized non-fat milk. Really good, that's great. And we got the two Triscuits. Okay, you're all caught up. This is what we're getting from Walmart and I'll let you know in the car how much we spent. Okay. Whew. We had to go back into the store because we forgot to pay for our milk. Mm. Have you ever done that? You put it like underneath and it was the only thing underneath. We didn't pay for it, so we went back in, huh guys? Mm -hmm. Okay, so that total came out to about, um, let me think, I bought some stuff for church, so I have to subtract that in the mass, so that was 15, so about $135, which, so that means we're about 80 bucks over. That kind of gives you a good idea of how much all of that convenience food actually cost you. So, you just gotta weigh out if you think it's worth it or not. All right, we're gonna plug in an audio book, audio book and drive home. Okay, let me know all your experience with house remodels, busy seasons of life. What things do you feel is worth your money to spend on to save you some time? Let's talk convenience meals down in the comments. Don't forget to check out those Costco meal ideas. I watch those videos multiple times to remind myself of like, okay, these are good. And they are out of the box. It's not just rotisserie chicken and a salad. They're really tasty meals, if I do say so myself. So, all right, don't forget to subscribe. We'll talk to you soon. Bye! Bye! Bye.